Hello friends, welcome to KP Tutorials. In this video, I am going to explain about how we can read a properties file. So, uh, before getting into the implementation side, let me explain about what is properties file and why it is a need for us to know how to improve how to read this particular properties file and. Um, uh we are going to explain about what how we can do it in real time and if you want any code if you want a code for this particular uh tutorial it is going to be available in my blog guys that is kbtutorials.blogspot.com you can go there and you can uh get that particular code as well okay this is my particular blog guys so you can come here and you can get that particular code as well so uh, any properties file if you observe the extension is dot properties okay that is the first uh, indication this is a properties file and it will have key value pairs guys here you have it is a key uh, then there will be a colon then the value key colon value okay so with the help of this particular key I am going to get the value like that and here it is a normal test and um, some other scenarios I have seen in few projects where they will use the XML as a properties file that is also will have dot uh, properties only but instead of this they will be having the uh, tags and uh, value names but that is very rare this is very common okay so I am going to explain about this one so this is the key value pair and why we need to use is any any uh, automation framework any java based framework any programming language you can take uh, if you have some constant values and some values which you want to control uh, from outer from outside instead of giving them in a code they'll use this particular properties file in in my case here an automation framework I am going to give URL from outside browser path implicit explicit weight and some other uh, key value pairs so if I want to change the URL I can come and I can change it here instead of uh, changing that in the code okay and how we can read that we are going to see and I have kept that e have okay in this particular path it is it is always a good example uh, standard as well uh, if you keep that in your project itself okay so let me go and explain how we can do this so this is my particular uh, properties file right guys so this is my path of that particular file I need this particular path okay so as it, it is here in source test resources config dot properties okay I have taken one uh, class and I have given some um, code here like the string path okay now properties file let me create one object for properties file properties props properties properties by right click mouse over on it change it to properties okay then here uh, cross is equal to let me create a new object for this particular property properties I am creating an object right then let me take file input stream since I am using the file over there uh, IP as new file input stream right guys and I am going to pass my string file path in this then I need to uh, import it then there will be a throws exception since it is file not found sorry there will be a file not found exception that I am going to use it in the throws if any case if the file is not found okay to load my properties first I need to use load method of input stream here is IP okay guys 
then it will load your properties file then how i am going to get those values let's say i have url here so for the url what i'll do is let me create one um, object called url string url and for another object for another value browser let me create one more as you can see here there is a browser right so for that i am creating one more variable called browser browser cool then url is equal to then you just need to use this particular object guys pause dot get property then pass your property that is url from how i know from opening my properties page and i'll come to know what is my username what is my keys here okay so i am going to get the value here in into this particular url object let's see is it coming or not now let me run this as a java application now you can see we got the url properly from the configuration file right guys so in a similar way let me try to get browser browse dot get property of all you need to do is you need to open your uh, properties well then only you will come to know what are the keys and values corresponding values over there okay let me use browser let me run it again now you can see for the browser key i have the value as chrome that i have got it here this is how we need to read a properties file guys simple properties object this is in uh, util class only this will be in util class only you just need to import it then to read a file i am using file input stream so for this it will throw an exception file what if the file is not existing so it will throw an exception file not found exception then you are going to load that particular properties file using the load method then you just need to use the get method to read those properties file and this is very very basic guys i hope you guys understood if you don't please let me know in the comment section so that i can help you more on this thank you for watching and please do explore other tutorials guys and Please do subscribe if you are not dead. Thank you.